Welcome to our service and group. This is the Beautiful Game Foundation. Inequalities faced by disabled people in different aspects of life. Due to these inequalities, disabled people are affected in their access to employment, education, and health. This causes them to be marginalized from social participation. 
There is also bias against them due to widespread prejudice and misunderstanding among the public regarding their ability to perform and compete in the job market. This is why their lives need to be improved. has mentioned about our social issue so now like, let's look at two perspectives towards our social issue so the first perspective is that um, some people think that these people with disabilities shouldn't be marginalized or they should be treated equally uh, as normal people and should be given equal rights and on the other side of the coin some people believe that uh, people with disabilities um, it's okay to marginalize them or some people even think that uh, it's okay if even if they don't get like certain jobs and because they don't deserve it. So let, let's look at two perspectives of uh, this social issue. a range of uh, disability rights into the UK law. So this includes um, the Human Rights Convention which prohibits discrimination against these groups of disabled people. And one of the purpose of this treaty is to promote, protect and ensure the full and equal employment of all human rights and ensure fundamental freedoms for all disabled people and to promote the respect for their inherent dignity. According to what doctors have said, some people think that formal laws are one thing but practical application is quite another thing. Unless disabled people are actually able to enjoy these rights in their days to day to day lives, some might question the point of having these laws at all. In their participatory workshops, adolescents claim that many employers did not believe that a disabled person could do a job. Other stakeholders perceived that adolescents with disabilities could work, but considered them capable of only performing certain menial jobs. As a result, employment in the corporate sector was seen by many to be unrealistic 
or unattainable and in Sarawak and Sabah there were fewer opportunities outside hospitality or handicrafts than in the peninsula. I think a way to combat this social issue would be to create more TV shows or movies that accurately portray the many different types of disabilities. So this solution can reach out to a wide range of audiences even around the world and it would banish many stereotypes of previous incorrect assumptions of what disabled people are capable of so they won't be treated with inequality in the confines of career jobs and stuff like that or even education so what the government can do in regards to supporting this solution is that they are able to fund organizations that are working on these shows and movies and they are also able to fund the qualified professionals to make sure that the disability shown in the TV shows and movies are accurate and the role that the society and us can take on in this solution would just to have an open mind and be open to understanding and identifying the many misinformation that are passed around.